Hey, all, EC here, and today I've got this Japanese version of Kuru Kuru Karin, and I want to test it on a European Game Boy Advance and see if this will work. Now, obviously, I do know the Game Boy Advance systems aren't region locked, like a lot of the Nintendo home consoles were back in the day. So, my, my biggest question with this game is, since it's a Japanese copy of this game, would there be an English dub, would there be other languages, because it was released in both uh, the UK, uh, Europe, and obviously... Japan, so let's have a look. Because weirdly enough, Kuku Room was never released in America. For a start. Okay. Okay, hon. So it does turn on. Let's see if I can find the settings and if there's a thing in the settings. So press start. Is there settings? Is there settings? So that's my character. So from what it seems, it seems there is no English translation. Okay, yeah, we died. Now, if you wondering why I have a copy of this game, when it's on Switch Online. Yeah, I'm not very good at this. But yeah, so the game does work on a European Game Boy Advance, it's just you can't translate it to English. But this is that's not my problem. Denise Miller Productions can deal with this. That's her thing. Anyway, guys, let me know your thoughts about this in the comments down below. Did you know that this... this did you... Did you, did you know this was, this would work? Because obviously the, the Game Boy Advance consoles aren't region locked, so the games in any version should work on here. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Uh, you can check out Kuro Kuro this, this game, by the way, is online. You can play it for perfectly fine. The European copies tend to go for about, from what I can see, like 50, 60 to 100 pound on eBay. Whilst this version was only like 11 pound, which is like 13 dollars. So yeah, I think that this is a good deal. Anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. I've been EC. Subscribe, and I'll see you next one. Peace.